Yes, I've been doing image consultancy for oh, many years, well over uh, 20, 28 years. And oh, it's wow. some, a long time, and it's something that I am just as passionate about as I was when I first started it. Um, because it's, it's, a, it's a journey where I have someone that rings me and says, I need help. I want to come and see you. I've lost my confidence in the way that I look. And that can be for whatever reason. It could be having a child, being out of the workforce, being a mum, getting back into the workforce, not knowing what suits them, marriage breakup, anything. It's just when a woman's lost her confidence and lost her direction. And so she comes to me and I advise her on how she can look her best. And for me, the most important thing is wearing your right colours. It's because it's it's so powerful and so strong, and there really is a truth in it. Because our, it's all to do with our skin tone. Our skin tone is either warm or cool, and colours that we wear are either warm or cool. And so, when you're wearing the wrong colour and it reflects up on the skin tone, if it is the wrong colour, it's going to do really nasty things, and you will never look your best when you wear your right colours. Now I'm feeling very conscious. <laughs> well, you're looking great. Okay. I love that colour in there. Well, this is one. This is definitely one of my colours, and I love it. And and colour makes you feel a certain way. You know, so often um, women are afraid of colour, mm. and then that's the lovely thing. Through a colour consultation, they go, "Oh my gosh, I never thought I could wear this." And they look in the mirror and they can see what the colour's doing to them. Because when you wear your right colours, it makes your skin look its best. But the most important thing is it pops your eye colour and it gives your lips a very strong definition and colour as well. So colour is paramount. And then the most important thing is, is knowing who you are. Because it's no good going shopping if you don't know who you are and what your style is. Because that's when you'll be walking to stores and you just don't know what suits you. So you have to work out who you are. And that's asking yourself some questions, you know, such as, how do, what do I feel? What, what, what do I do for a job? What do I do in my life? What things make me feel good? Do I like lots of colour? Do I like pretty pastel colours? Do I like florals? Do I like block colours? Do I like tailored clothes? Do I like beautiful feminine ruffles? You've got to work out what your style is. And then once you've got your style, you put your stamp on it, and it's your style. And that's why I love French women. You can go to, mm. go to France, and you can go to Paris, and sit and have a coffee and watch women walk past. You will not know what's in fashion. You don't know what the latest trends are, because you'll see so many different looks, and they're all wearing their own look with confidence. Their clothes don't wear them, they wear their clothes. And they've found their formula that works for their body shape, because you've got to know what works for your body shape. It's no good following a fashion fad if it doesn't suit you. For example, over the knee boots, they come in. Well, if you're tall and you've got thin legs, you can wear over the knee boots. If you don't have that, your body shape's not like that, you're going to look silly. Um, the latest colour we're seeing this summer, which is that lovely bright canary yellow. Again, if it's not your colour, you're not going to look great. I mean, I will not wear it because it's not one of my colours. Um, you just have to be careful with fashion. Fashion's fantastic, it's exciting, it's changing. But I think that, you know, for a woman, the most important thing is finding out what her style is and sticking with it, and then you will feel confident. Nothing looks worse when you see a woman who's put on clothes because it's the latest fashion style and it doesn't suit them and they don't look confident. Indeed. You know, high heel shoes, if you can't walk elegantly in a pair of high heel shoes, do not wear them because you will look stupid. And people will notice that you're walking, you know, in an uncomfortable way. You know, the French women, they wear their ballet flats because they've worked it out. They're the most comfortable, you know. Love ballet flats. They're fantastic, aren't they? So can anyone come and see you? Anyone can come and see me, and, I, and again, that's the what I love about my job because I get to meet some amazing women. They allow me to come into their home, which is a great privilege, and it's women of all backgrounds, all shapes and sizes, um, and we work together. It's a very intimate relationship, 
and it is a bit of a journey because obviously my client wants a result at the end. For me, the result is that they're feeling fantastic. Hi, thank you so much for spending time with us today. Oh, it's been it's great. Been it's a been a pleasure. You know, I, you. I just think it's really, you know, life is about choices, and I think it's really important, you know, to everyone that's been listening and, and who are following you to be informed. Mm. And you're obviously going to be offering, you know, the people that are watching you some wonderful information. Thank you. So thanks guys. That wraps up our time with the gorgeous Lorraine Downs. I'm sure you'd agree with me that she's an inspiration and we're very lucky to have her as one of our ambassadors in our country. Talk to you soon.